take a look at what uh, technique I used to catch that uh, great little rainbow trout. Um, this is a significantly fast piece of the river and some people may go buy it. Um, I put a woolly bugger on because we're right in between, you know, the caddis fly and the, and the spruce moth um, hatch. So I wanted to prospect and see if I could pull something out of this. Um, but as I said, the water's quick. So if I was to just regularly swing it across, that fly in the speed of water would whip right across the, the river and it would fly by fish. And chances are they might chase it, but they're probably gonna miss it. So what, uh, what I'm doing is I'm casting 45 across and I'm putting a big upstream mend in it and following the line down on a tight line. And as the S curves in the line, I'm redoing that upstream mend and I'm pulling slowly on my own speed control that woolly bugger across all the current and all the seams within the river. That way, the fly is not ripping across, the fish get a chance to see it, you can even go left to complete the side of the river, and uh, you got a, you've got more of a chance to have the fly in the strike zone of the fish. So, once again, 45 across, big upstream mend, follow it down on a tight line. As your S curve happens, another upstream mend, as it comes across, as the S forms, keep it going right across. Control your speed across the river and you will present the fly in a slow enough manner that when these fish do eat, they've got a great chance of getting it out. It's a deadly technique. It works great. Oh, it's a nice one too. So when you're waiting for the hatches to change or for a hatch to go off, search. Use a search pattern, try to find out what they're eating. Because they're not only eating bugs, they'll eat terrest you know, high protein, high protein meals. Another very nice rainbow, fun. And there's the fly. Just a bead headed, green, woolly bugger. Olive woolly bugger. A little bit of flash, crystal bugger. Does a trick. Whoa! Gone. Quick release. Didn't get to show them to you. <laughs> That's the way it goes. Fish. Nice. Feels like a good one, too. Hopefully it's a brown. Staying down. Yes, it is a brown trout. Great. I didn't think we'd get a chance to dance with a brown today because of the high sun. But I managed to get one on, on the woolly bugger. River's known for great brown trout and great rainbows. And I've been hoping, hoping, hoping that we could catch a brown trout out of here. And sure enough, here we go. And it hit just a big thud, just a thud. Nice, so good. Come on and take a look at this. <laughs> 